Hi guys, I'm going to show you how to create your pixel art in After Effects in a fast and easy way so you can turn your artwork or animation into pixel art pretty easily. Here are some examples I did in the past and I'm going to show you how I created a pixelated coin in this video. So let's jump into it. So we're going to create a new composition and I'm using 1080p, 25 frames per uh, second but feel free to use your own composition settings and I'm going to trim my composition to 4 seconds so you don't need more than that and I also I will import my uh, coin which I designed in Illustrator I'm going to link this file in, in the description below so feel free to use my design if you want to follow this but also you can use your own design to follow this tutorial. So after when you import the file, drag and drop it into your timeline. Double click in the precomp and we're going to turn the base to shape layer and you can delete the original layer, we don't need that. And also I'm going to parent the face to the coin and if you can't see that icon there make sure you right click there go to columns and make sure the parent is checked and also if you go to composition settings make sure in the 3d renderer you use cinema 4d renderer because we're going to extrude the coin in 3d space turn all of the layers to 3D layer and we're going to use a top view on the left side um, so I'm going to bring the face a little bit forward and um, I'm going to extrude as you can see on the top view you can see I'm extruding the coin in 3D space And I'm going to duplicate the face, the, the coin face, and parent it to the base. And also I'm going to put this uh, dollar sign on the back side of the coin. I'm going to rotate the coin. So see, you can see there is uh, the dollar sign as well, but you know, it's facing the wrong, wrong way. So I'm going to flip it to the other side. So hit S and we're going to change the scale settings so with the minus we can flip it horizontally so the dollar sign is facing the right direction now which is good so put the rotation back to the original position we're going to make a rotating a 3d rotating animation for the coin so just enter 360 as you can see it's already there is a linear rotation and I'm going to hit F9 for the keyframes which is easy ease the keyframes and I'm going to play with the accelerations a little bit I'm going to uh, start a bit slower and accelerate faster and slow down we're going to check the animation with the RAM preview. So wait for it, your RAM preview and check your animation. As you can see it's a little bit slow so I'm going to push the keyframes a bit forward. Okay it's looking good. When you're happy with your animation, we're going to create an adjustment layer and we're going to put uh, pixelated effects and everything into the adjustment layer. You can rename it to effects or leave it to adjustment layers. And the first effect we're going to use is called mosaic. And grab it from the stylized section and 
drag and drop your adjustment layer as you can see it's already there is a default settings you can adjust the two horizontal and vertical uh, settings for your best result and check sharp corners which I always use for pixelated design as you can see the animation is already uh, pixelated I adjust the, the pixel settings a little bit more higher which I'm very happy with it at the moment <coughs> okay it's looking good so the second effect is going to be posturous time which is a cool effect I use when I have to animate a retro style animation or stop motion style animation but this is suitable for pixel style animation just drag it drop into your uh, adjustment layer and we're going to adjust the frame rate to around 14 basically this one even if I use in my composition section 25 frames per second that layer is um, moving in a lower frame rate so pretty much uh, half of the speed so every second frame is going to be animated so in that example you can compare the posturized times on the left and the original animation on the right that's the difference next effect we're going to use called light sweep cc light sweep and i'm going to drag and drop it on my coin animation as you can see there is a default uh, effect but I'm going to use smooth feel free to play with the different settings for this one but I think this should be fine and for an animation we're going to animate the center the center settings so just hit the stopwatch and you can create a keyframe and we're going to animate the center of this light sweep and just easy ease the animation with F9 and also I'm going to adjust the animation in the MoGraph editor make it a little bit more dynamic and check the animation again with the RAM preview so this is how to create a pixel latest style animation in a fast and easy way and you can use this method to your animation even if you have only just a rendered footage you can you can use these effects and methods to turn your animation or design to pixelated art easily i hope you find this useful if you did please give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button if you haven't already until then see you guys in the next one